Good morning, America. My name is Jeff Gogel. Today I'm going to present my idea on how to eliminate global warming, the man-made part and the Mother Nature-made part. Here's a 30-mile cross-section of our atmosphere. The red line is the atmospheric collapse rate, temperature versus height. At the surface, temperature is an average of plus 50 degrees Fahrenheit. It then falls to minus 50 degrees Fahrenheit at seven miles up. Continues at minus 50 until 12 miles up. Then it starts to rise, reaching zero degrees Fahrenheit at 25 miles up. That means in the lower atmosphere, the lapse rate is minus five degrees for every thousand foot rise in elevation. And this is the essence of my global warming solution. I will move a thousand feet of our hot lower atmosphere into the colder atmosphere. The entire upper atmosphere will drop downward, lowering surface temperature five degrees Fahrenheit over the entire surface of the planet. How can I do this? The Global Warming Exhaust Funnel, GEF, or Jeff for short. Ten miles in diameter at the base, ten miles high, and thirty miles in diameter across the top. Ten miles in diameter intake, eighty-eight square miles total intake area, and ten feet per second updraft. That's four point eight million cubic miles per year of exhaust air coming out of the top here. To force the air up, I propose number one, solar power. Line the inside of the GEF with mylar so that when the sun shines, it concentrates the air or the solar power down on the air at the bottom of the funnel and encourages it to rise. Number two, build a 1,000 megawatt power plant discharging heat into the Jeff. Again, causing updraft. And number three, intake fans, forcing air into the funnel and up into the upper atmosphere. For the 1,000 foot atmosphere layer, I calculated required exhaust volume of 42 0.2 million cubic miles. Earth's surface area, 211 million square miles, times a fifth of a mile, 42.2 million cubic miles to raise that atmosphere up. Exhaust time is 42.2 divided by 4.8, that's 8.8 .8 years. Global warming gone in under 10 years. The funnel I'm proposing is a lighter than air structure, fabricated as a single layer of hydrogen filled balloons, average thickness of 10 inches. The surface area of the Jeff is 890 square miles. Outer layer may be 50% more than the inner layer. Total plastic film needed is 2,280 square miles. Here's my thought on how we'll build this. We'll build it in little wedge sections of balloon, maybe a hundred foot at a time, fabricate it on the ground, weld it to the fabric and just let the whole thing rise in the air. Then we'll move it over here, attach it to the others. Again, welding, thermal welding. Here's my little welding device right here. And a railroad to carry these things around. 
So here's what the cost estimate looks like. 890 square miles of film, times two and a half, times two cents a square foot. That's $1.24 billion just to build a funnel. Then we'll need anchors to hold this down for both vertical and lateral forces, fans, infrastructure, a thousand megawatt lifter power plant, site development. Altogether, this is $16.7 billion. Add 50% for plan, specification, estimate, legal fees, land acquisition, and then double that as 100% contingency, and I need a budget of $50 billion to build this. Will it work? I don't know. I'll need a lot of help to find out. An atmospheric scientist, Patrick J. Michaels maybe? Toth Technologies out of Canada. They specialize in lighter than air structures. AECOM, largest engineering firm in the world. Financing, maybe the Gates Foundation. And many, many others. Together, we can save the planet. If you want to be part of the Jeff team, give me a call.